It's surveillance video that shocked everyone who saw it, including us. A driver slams into a bicyclist and just keeps going. As that man continues to recover tonight, local advocates are pushing for change. New at 10, New Channel 5's Emily Luxon is just back from a gathering of the group Walk, Bike, Nashville. Emily, what are they doing so this doesn't happen again? Well, tonight they brought attention to the issue with the Ride of Silence. It honors cyclists who were injured or killed while riding on public roads. But the group is also hoping that Nashville will continue to take steps to make roads safer for everyone. Thanks everybody for coming out. It's become an annual tradition in Nashville. The idea of the Ride of Silence is really to take a moment to remember and reflect um, on those bike riders who have been seriously injured or killed. Members of Walk Bike Nashville hope the Ride of Silence sends a message loud and clear. We really are hoping to raise awareness for cyclist safety. Participants also hope the five mile ride brings attention to the dangers cyclists face on the road. I ride my, my bicycle to work on a daily basis and there are always close calls. Others aren't as lucky. The most recent crash involving a cyclist was caught on surveillance video. A pickup truck hit 53-year-old Roman Alvarez on Old Hickory Boulevard, dragging him down the road. The driver then took off. Cyclists say Alvarez was doing everything right and was still seriously hurt. They couldn't have done anything better in those incidents, so it's just... It, it just is very, very disheartening. While cyclists say Nashville roads have been improved, more still needs to be done as the city continues to grow. Of course, more bike lanes are always helpful. Uh, things like bike boxes that increase visibility have been shown to help. And then I'd, I'd like to see a lot of more of those protected bike lanes. They hope this ride will encourage city leaders and drivers to do their part to keep roads safe. People are still adjusting to having more and more cyclists on the road. and. Just, just knowing that we're there is a big help. This week, Mayor Megan Berry announced details of her capital spending plan. That includes $30 million for sidewalks and $5 million for greenways. Walk Bike Nashville says that is a step in the right direction, but the plan still has to be approved by Metro Council. Reporting live in the newsroom, Emily Luxon, News Channel 5. Emily, thank you. Similar rides were held in hundreds of cities worldwide to honor cyclists who were hurt or killed on public roads.